It's not uncommon for Lockheed Martin in Fort Worth to work in secret, but this latest project with NASA, they've tried to keep really quiet. It's like a, just a thump, a thump thump as it goes by, much like uh, your neighbor closing their car door from about 50 feet away. It's a project many experts have worked on and failed for the past 50 years, supersonic air travel. Supersonic jets like the Concorde flew faster than the speed of sound and could deliver passengers to their destinations in half the time as most commercial airliners. The problem with going so fast is the sonic boom. They are, almost sound like little bombs going off. They're very startling. Grandmothers uh, probably had heart attacks, you know, things of that nature. I'm mean, just a very uh, alarming, it's a very alarming, like, what, what just happened? Because of that, supersonic flight over land was banned in 1973. Ever since then, engineers reasoned that if they could make a sonic boom quieter, they could revolutionize air travel, which is why Lockheed and NASA invited everyone here Friday, because they believe they've done it. This is the first airplane born from the ground up with the intention of having a low sonic boom. The sonic boom from this new plane, the X-59, Sounds like a car door shutting in the distance. The plane was engineered and built in California and is in Fort Worth to undergo testing before it takes its first test flight later this year. We'll be able to fly to our interna international destinations in half the time. Which would be a real revolution in, in travel. Because if supersonic travel can get off the ground, business is sure to be booming. In Fort Worth, I'm Sean Giggy.